The Patia City Expats Club is a non-profit social organisation and our speakers are volunteers. The club as such assumes no responsibility or liability for the professional reputation of or the quality of services provided by the speaker today. Big mango production is coming up in Bangkok. It's in your newsletter if you want to read about it. But apparently he's going to give us a plug right now for it. Mike Gold, where are you? Behind me. This is very good for your sex life because your girlfriends would love to come to this event, I'm sure. Um, I'm actually uh, an expat like you. I live here in Thailand for the last 10, 10 years. I'm sorry? Closer. Closer, okay. Um, and uh, I've been in six years here in Pattaya, and before arriving in Asia, uh, I used to have a career in fashion exhibitions, uh, before becoming the editor of the Thai Golf News and the Pattaya Golfer, which some of you may have read, we don't publish anymore, but we still have a Facebook. And I originally came from London, uh, and two things I missed most when I came to Thailand were good roast potatoes on a Sunday, and good theatre. I'm, I'm from a theatre background. My father was a producer, and my brother is the lighting designer for Phantom of the Opera. And uh, on my bucket list, I had two things I wanted to do. One was uh, to write my autobiography, which I've just written, so a little plug on Amazon. Uh, Benny Hill to Bangkok is the name of the book. I used to work on the Benny Hill show, if any of you saw that show a long time ago. And the second thing I wanted to do was to produce my own shows. So with another old age pensioner, a friend of mine from the UK, we set up uh, our company Big Mango Productions uh, back in January. And uh, we went on to first of all produce our first show at the Thailand Cultural Centre in January called London's West End Men. Quite a lot of people came up from Bangkok to see it. And what we did was we uh, employed four major stars from London's West End, and we booked the 45 musicians from the Royal Bangkok Symphony Orchestra, and uh, put on a show that was perhaps a bit, a bit adventurous for us two old age pensioners. We had 150 people in the production with stars and backstage and everything. And it was quite a big event, but it, it worked. And now what we have done is we've created, over the last six months, our own production called Broadway in Bangkok Unplugged. People say, why unplugged? Well, in fact, we do have plugs because we've got a PA system, but it's a lot more intimate. And so here is a short promo of the show. star Harriet and both these singers are not just cabaret singers off the streets they've actually performed in these productions you can imagine how much competition there is to get a lead role in a musical either on Broadway or in, in London there are only 12 major musicals in each city and these two who are coming to Bangkok next month or this month now have actually managed to do that in addition uh, we've also got um, two excellent musicians, uh, a pianist and a, uh, and a keyboard. In fact, Jason, who some of you may know, who plays around the clubs in Patio, is one of these musicians. And we're also very lucky to have the winners of the 2019 Royal Bangkok Symphony Orchestra's Young Talent Contest. And they're going to be singing from the ages between 9 and 17. I've just been to see the rehearsals, and they're phenomenal. And of course, what they get is that they get to, a chance to rehearse and perform with these two superstars in musical theatre. So it's a fantastic opportunity for them. 
The show will naturally feature melodies from The Miserable, which is what Anne starred in, and Phantom of the Opera, which is what Harriet starred in, along with songs from Wicked, West Side Story, which I'm sure most of you know, Rent, and Beauty and the Beast, because Harriet was actually in the movie Beauty and the Beast as well. Uh, and so, during the 80-minute show, Dan, Dan and Harry will also chat about their experiences, all about the backstage gossip uh, and what happens in um, a big Broadway and West End show. Here's a recent interview we did in London. Hi, so my name is Daniel Cook. Um, I'm a co-producer and kind of lead singer on uh, Broadway in Bangkok Unplugged. The style of the show Unplugged, it's, um, it's, a, it's a more paired, uh, paired back, kind of intimate uh, soiree evening, if you like. And we're really excited. We're going to be singing some stuff, obviously, from the musicals we've been in and we know and we love. A bit more of a relaxed feel uh, with accompaniment with the piano. Songs from some of the really well known ones like Phantom and Les Mis and Miss Saigon, and of course, um, some of the Disney show songs put in there as well. Uh, fabulously talented kids from uh, the local choir involved, and uh, also a finalist from the Royal Bangkok Symphony Orchestra's Young Talent Competition, so she's, um, she's one to watch for sure. It's going to be a great evening, it's going to be very exclusive, very intimate, um, and we're really looking forward to seeing you there. So, bottom line is the Aksara Theatre, where we've chosen to put this event on, is in Victory Monument in Bangkok, very easy to get to. It's, during, it's, it's actually located in the King Park complex, so if you're driving up from Pattaya, it's easy to park. And if any one of you would like to join us, um, all members of today's club, we would like to offer you a 25% discount on tickets. Uh, they come start at 1,000 baht up to 2,500, so it's not going to break the bank. And if any of you are keen to go to the show and want to use the discount code, all you need to do is to come up and I'll give you the details afterwards. Go to our ticket agency, tieticketmajor.com, and then you'll be able to book online. Um, I think that basically if you are starved like I was of good quality entertainment, um, here is a chance for you to actually see two mega stars from the British musical scene in a really nice atmosphere and it's a chance for you to enjoy a good night out and as I say I think your, your partner will enjoy it and you will enjoy the trip home. So if you want any more details just come up to the stage and I'll give you all the details. Thank you very much. It sounds like a great evening. Uh, some, of the, some of the moves, stuff from uh, Les Mis and the Phantom were just uh, some of the greatest music uh, in our time. I thought, being an old guy, I thought, you know, the old sound of music in uh, My Fair Lady, I thought those are the great songs, but, but there's been some great writers even uh, since then. It's been great. Uh, I am told.